Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to Liam. Happy birthday to you. Well done, mate. High five. Boosh. What up, YouTube? It's me, it's me, it's your favourite, it's uh, there. as well. Um, I haven't been to work today. My wife made me stay at home. Um, was Chuck chucking my ring up this morning. Was, actually, he's chucking your ring up at me in Wolverhampton. Maybe, he was vomiting. I was vomiting. Chucking my ring up could mean something else. Um, but yeah, I was vomiting this morning, just felt rough. So you'd made me stay at home, but I think I've... I left my work in a bit of a pickle, but... Oh well. Uh, but it was the son's birthday today. Th the big three. Um, getting old now. Um, oh, hang on. <laughs> oh. Excuse us, D. Sorry. Um. I look better. Uh, I was thinking, as soon as I have nothing for this vlog. What do you want? Um, um, what's going on with Liam at the minute? Um, he's had speech and language this week and started physio again. And also the early years special needs woman come to see him today and do some assessments. Mm. Um, so it's just appointments, appointments, appointments. Right, how many appointments have you been to this week or had? Three. Four. Huh? Oh no, three. the one didn't turn up today. Mm, so Potential of four. Three this week, two next week, three the week after. And then I think it's down to one for a short while because he'll have finished physio and speech and language. And I'm doing this in between work and mm. having to work my hours back. I find it weird at the minute because, like, I, was, I went I went to bed when the lady come because the last time we were here I was kind of didn't not that I didn't agree with what she was saying but I find it hard not to interrupt mm. or go like yeah. do you know what I mean I find it hard yeah but what about this they're, yeah you might say that but what about they're this? kind of I find it hard not to do that so I, I they're giving you their professional yeah I I felt like crap so I went <laughs> I went to bed um but it's weird like. Obviously, they can't. I think that if they did it in a way that there was just one person who knew most of it or whatever, but you just find a lot of people knowing one thing. He's seen so many different professionals for different things, and, and then they, some of them don't know that he's got issues in other areas, so yeah. it's hard to. So they're kind of like, oh, well, you need to do this and you need to do that, but then you're getting told by someone else that. Mm -hmm. Whatever keeps him relaxed and happy, and so, so it's what just they're doing. And I, to be fair, I think we've said this before in the vlog, mm. but it's, it, it is hard. Um, but yeah, they're having a, they're arranging a meeting, though, aren't they? But yeah. but yeah, just thought I haven't really. He's just been having lots of. Um, what? I'm having fringe issues. <laughs> okay, <laughs> go wash my head tomorrow morning. Fringe. I just um, um it's hard it's really hard and because he's got limited understanding and stuff like that then it can make other things harder and I think one of the things you were saying the other day look, mm. one of the consultants said about that in not understanding what we're talking about and I mm. don't think it is that. I think he understands what we're saying, you know that I don't think there's I ever, don't think he always I don't does. think there's ever a point. I don't find up. I find if if I'm chatting to him, mm. he knows what I'm talking to him about. What they said is that he picks up on a lot of 
he repeats a lot of stuff or he might understand certain situations but he doesn't actually understand like um what's the word if you put it in other quite a lot into the sort of um, situations if you know what I mean um but I don't know it's hard it's really hard and if he doesn't understand stuff or doesn't want to do something he'll ignore you and throw oh, himself yeah. away from the if situation he doesn't understand something completely um, and the other thing speech and language said this week is when he's um she said imagine if you're in a room so when he's with like around other people you're in a room full of people who are talking in a language you don't understand and she said that's basically how he feels um, and so he gets frustrated easily um, he might if other people are talking he might start babbling and making sounds and stuff like that because he can't understand what the people are saying even though they might not be talking to him so he has to block that sound out she said um, and she said it's kind of like you know you can't like, if you're trying to give him directions or whatever and he just completely might just be like oh, he's complete there is, there are, I think there are people like they're just completely blank who aren't they mm. he's very blatant he mm. just I don't know what you're talking about I don't want to talk about it I don't want to do from this the I'm going to walk off and I'm going to do what I want mm. which is one of the things when he gets to school we've obviously got to keep an eye on but he starts in January mm. um, but yeah he's three today Yep, already. Um, yeah, already. <laughs> I was worried that he, like, he didn't get, you know what I mean, he didn't get it, it, it was his birthday today. So I had to look back on photos of when it was Lacey's third birthday. And to be fair, I think she just about got it. I think she got it. I think obviously he doesn't I don't think understand. she got that well, I'm three, like today, I'm three years old, I'm getting Yeah, presents. it didn't get he that. Didn't, it's my birthday, I'm getting presents. He got a thing off. Sorry. I'm getting new toys. But then when you brought the best cake out and start singing happy birthday, mm. he, can't he gets them, that he? kind of thing, I think. But yeah. And he started singing it to himself. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, he's the big three today. He's growing, he's grew up so much over mm. the last three years. Mm. But hopefully, I'm hoping that he gets past it, but I'm not, don't care if he does. It, I think I'll some of the it. elements are always going to be it, there. I don't see it as a thing. We'll deal with it. It just means like adapting there's, certain situations. And yeah, there's there's a lot of people things. that kind of... I, I don't know, I know a lady who has got a daughter who's 18, I think. Mm. And um, kind of got the same symptoms as Liam, and I, 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 know the, I know the girl as well. And when you talk to the girl, it's... That's her. If you speak to her, she's very. You, you you don't get within. I don't know, an half an hour conversation with her without it being brought up that she's got this thing. Mm. But she's physically fine, if you know what I mean. Nothing. And that's the hard thing about these sorts of conditions. Yeah. So I think the way, while well, I want to approach it anyway, is not pointing out. Mm. But be understanding when there's certain things he might yeah, yeah. struggle with or he might be delayed in, yeah. you know. But anyway, um, the time is going down. <laughs> Sorry. So, yeah, tomorrow we're going to... We've got dance class as normal. We're going to see Life Center tomorrow, aren't we? We're going to take him to see the fishes. Mm-hmm. It could be an absolute fail. Which it might be. Which it might be. Because it's an afternoon visit and... Yeah, so they'll probably both be tired. And then there'll be a crap load of people around. Yeah, because we've got to get the train and... Mm. It might not be too busy, hopefully, at mm. that time. Mostly. Mm. But anyway, for now, thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow at the fishing place. Mm. Fishing place. Fishing. Peace out. Adios. Adios. Ciao. Stay beautiful. Stay safe. Mm. <laughs>